Hello you freaks out there, all you styrene freaks. Uh, this is a video of the final um, vinyl kit build here of the Emperor Palpatine, the Star Wars. It's the Shadows of the Empire and all that, collector edition, blah 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 blah. So there's the box. And there he is. There you go. Um, there, I think that works. Yeah, uh, obviously, uh, pretty easy to put together. Um, the only issue would be his left arm. Um, there is a little bit of a gap on the back there, but uh, using the good old uh, uh, the Valley Ho uh, Vallejo uh, uh, <laughs> putty um, works really awesome, really well with uh, the figures. Um, I believe uh, Chris, yeah, Chris, uh, Classic Plastic, it's one of his go-tos for his uh, figure, you know, for uh, fill, filling in gaps and all that stuff. Chris, correct me if I'm wrong, but I believe I've seen uh, some of your videos of that. But, um, yeah, it works really great. Uh, it's an acrylic kind of a filler or whatever. And, uh, yeah, so, um, so you don't even really notice it. When I, uh, I'll have a slideshow at the end of this, so... Uh, pretty much uh, put it together and uh, primed it and uh, I got ahead and left it a uh, flat black uh, his robes and all that stuff so um, obviously you know robes aren't too glossy or whatever unless they're made of leather or something like that kind of kinky but um yeah um so I left that flat uh, that's gonna be an awesome dust collector. Uh, anyways, uh, all our model kits are usually dust collectors unless we put them in displays. Um, anyways, and then I gone ahead and I did the the model color, did Vallejo, uh, did the medium flesh tone on the skin. And uh, after that, I gone ahead and gave it a highlight, uh, or dry brush highlight. Dry brush, whatever, highlight, what do you want to call it? Dry brush, dry brush. Uh, I did this. I used a pale sand. Um, it's more towards a like a dirty white or whatever. So I use that. Because I'm a different kind of breed, you know. Anyway, <laughs> you guys could probably be rolling your eyeballs or whatever. But uh, yeah, I do not claim to be a master builder. Average Joe. I tried to go with the box art there. He's kind of, you know, he's got a little bit of a white highlights or whatever. So, and if you see his eyes are kind of pink or whatever. So I used, I used, where'd you go? Where'd you, ah, there it is. We don't wear pink shirts, do we guys? We wear salmon shirts. Anyways, uh, use the salmon rose around his eyes there. Here, there, around the eyes. Um, I also used the uh, Vallejo, uh, most of these paints are all Vallejo, as you can see. I used the, the pale yellow for the eyeballs. Obviously, dot the pupils black. Um, and then I used, uh, for the whites of the eye, I used the like, old, old, I still have some, surprise it's still, uh, the old, uh, Citadel bleach bone. I still got a whole bunch of this stuff. This, I mean, this is old. Um... Yeah, and then I did the pale yellow for the eyeballs and then dot the uh, pupil black. I came close to using some of these um, Archer uh, decals, ta -da, the eyeballs. I haven't used them yet. I'm kind of hesitant, but uh, I may start using some of these some of these figures here because they do have a size there for it. So, anyways, I'm labbing off. Um, the cane if they call for black but i went to a good old uh it's a citadel scorched brown and then i uh gave it a uh, uh the citadel leather snake skin a uh, highlight on it and then a strong tone uh, black wash for it so it's you can see brown you can see the highlight whatever blah 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 yeah it's a little shiny buddy um now with the skin after i put the what you call it i did the fingernails in a left off left off uh Luftwaffe, uh, uniform, kind of bluish gray. And then uh, for his lips, you can see he's kind of got a purplish, I don't know what you call it, but uh, it's a different weird lip, man. So Mace Windu, man, just messed his face up. Um, I used the foundation color, Citadel. 
<sighs> Astromican Gray. It's an old paint. They have some weird names, man. It's, it's like a bluish gray. And then uh, put on the flesh wash for the skin. Ta-da! And then I went. I want to give him a kind of a purple hue because this is my model kit. This is the way I build it, man. My, my. Um, I've gone ahead and gave it a purple tone, a very light purple tone in there. So, anyways, that's what I did, and that's my Emperor Emperor Palpatine. And so, so I'm happy with him. Looks kind of like him. He's just a old man there walks around with a cane and then when they get in freaking Jedi lightsaber fights they jump around like some acrobats like Yoda walking around and then he's all jumping around flipping around making somersaults in the air good grief so all right I'm talking too much uh, it's going to six minutes slideshow following uh, thank you for all your thank you to all subscribers and um, it's fun it's a fun kit so uh, thanks for your time and thanks for watching Take care. Have a great weekend. More on the way. See ya. That's my big fat sausage dump. Yeah. Game over, man. It's game over.